In this WebEasy hosting tutorial, we will go over the steps to setting up a connection profile in your WebEasy Professional. An occasion may arise when you need to utilize the third-party publisher as a troubleshooting measure if something on your computer is conflicting with the WebEasy publisher. And the Transfer Files tool is resourceful when it comes to moving individual files to your file manager online. In order to connect with these services, you will need to set up a connection profile. To set up a connection profile, you will need your FTP information, which you can locate by going to webeasyhosting.com and log into your cPanel. In your cPanel, scroll down to the Files section and click on FTP Accounts. You can access your main FTP account by scrolling down to the first user under Special FTP Accounts. Click on Configure FTP Client, and information will drop down for your connection profile. In WebEasy, first, name your connection profile. This will save your information for future use. The hostname or IP address is listed as FTP server in your FTP info. You can copy the information from your cPanel and paste it into the connection profile to avoid mistakes. As you can see, the user identifier in most cases will be a truncated version of your WebEasy username. The user password is the same as your WebEasy billing password. Under the General tab, Initial Remote folder should be public underscore HTML and the initial local folder should already be set to the correct HTML folder in your documents. The firewall tab is good as is, and you can hit OK to complete the connection profile. Then, with your hosting account connected, you are free to manually select files and choose Upload to send them to your file manager on our server. The third-party publish tool publishes full website packages that are built to your HTML folder. As you can see, your connection profile is remembered. However, in the third-party publish tool, an additional tab is required where the site is published to. So click on the www site tab and your full site URL goes in the first field. An index page should always be index.html or index.htm. Click OK and the third-party publisher will connect to your hosting account to publish your website online. And that's all there is to it. If you have any questions, you can reach us by phone at 855-490-0540, by emailing support at webeasyhosting.com, or by starting a live chat at webeasyhosting.com. Thanks for watching.